Okay. So we came from three, we went underneath, we came up to four on top of, then we came to the left of it and we went underneath the master chord. Then we crossed over this left and underneath the first horizontal. And so now you can see that that looks real similar to this one. This has an additional twist on it, but that's okay. So then we're gonna go, mostly you wanna make sure that you got this X in between the first horizontal and the master chord from this advance. Okay, I'm gonna call that an advance anyways. I'm not quite sure if it is, but it'll work. So it's just a, another girth hitch here. And this is number five. Okay. All right, so, and then I'm gonna come across here and then I'm looking at horizontals, go underneath lefts and on top of rights and there'll be another girth here. Okay, so we went from five underneath a left on top of a right to six did a girth hitch now we're going up to seven seven's up here on the crossbar okay so you got to make sure that you're weaving this as you go this is a right the one that we're weaving with is a left lefts go underneath the rights and then on top of horizontals it comes on top of the crossbar and we're going to do this cool little twisty thing again So we come to the left, we go over to the right, and then when we're on the right, we're gonna come underneath that master chord. And do that X in between the master chord and the first horizontal. Okay, so we came over the top, we came to the left of it, to the right of it, underneath the master chord and made the X and now this is a right. Rights go underneath horizontals. Underneath, horizontal, horizontal. Okay? And so now we're headed towards eight. Eight is on the other side of three, which is down here. Now we want to make sure that this is a right. Rights go on top of a left. Goes on top of a left. And because it's the bottom one, sorry, because it's the bottom one, you start from underneath versus on top of the top. Underneath the bottom, on top of the top. Makes sense, huh? So we're going to come down here to that lower cross piece. This is eight, and then we're going to go up to nine, and nine is an advance. So that's something a little different. All right. So once again, you want to come to the right of it. So you've got that X down here. See that X? X here, X there. And we're going to come up to nine. Nine is an advance on five. So we're going to actually come up to that girth hitch and go over the top of it. Okay, so I've come from eight. I've gone underneath it. Uh, I've gone underneath it to come around and then I've gone to the right of it. And then I'm coming up to do an advance on, actually it's on number five. So you come on top of it. On top of it. Okay, so this is a, we're going from eight to nine. It's an advance on number five hitch, okay? So you go on top of, you come to the right of it. It's gonna cross over here, and then we're gonna do number 10. Now it's a little bit different on a right side, but this is a left side advance. And I'll show you a right side advance when we get there. So it goes over the top, comes to the right, crosses over, and then I'm gonna do my number 10 hitch here, okay? Okay, so we did our advance on nine, we came over here and did a uh, girth hitch on 10. And then we made sure that horizontal was underneath the lefts and on top of the rights. And we did a girth hitch here at 11. 
and now we're coming down to 12, which is down on the crossbar. Remember, when you come down to the bottom, it's underneath. Underneath. And then we're going to come on the right-hand side of it. And then this is the last of our ties up on the top crossbar. So as I come up, this is a left. Lefts are always underneath rights and on top of... On top of... Um, Horizontals, okay? So all the way up. Now, you go on top, on the, on, the, on, on the top crossbar, top on the top crossbar, and then come back to the left. Pull this through again. It is getting shorter. It still is a lot of pulling. Just think if you had to keep it wet which you don't. Okay, so I'm going to come back over here, across it to the right, and then I'm going to go underneath that master cord. Pull that through. And so I'm getting the X. That X here between the master cord and the first horizontal. So that's my number 12, and now I'm headed to 13. I'm sorry, that was 13, and now I'm looking for 14. 14 is going to be down here, okay? And I can check that by saying, okay, master cord, start of the lacing, 5, 10. This is now 14 and 18. 18 is going to be an advance on it. Okay, and we're going to do 14 to 15. I'm going to get this hitched on here. And, um, and so this is now a uh, right. Rights go underneath the horizontal and on top of the lefts. So I'm going to weave this through here so you can see it. I'll weave it first and then I'll pull it through. So you don't have to watch me pulling, pulling, pulling. All right, so this is underneath. This is over a left. Underneath a horizontal and over a left. you got to remember where you're at. And underneath a horizontal, okay? And then I'm going to come over here and do that girth hitch. Okay, so then we're going to go from 15 up to 16. This is the first time you're going to use the master cord as a turning point and it's going to go on top of it, okay? So you got your uh, girth hitch here and this is a left. Lefts go on top of horizontals and underneath the right. On top of horizontal, underneath the right. On top of horizontal and the master cord is considered one two, so that's two on top of. You go around it and then you come to the right and then we're going to go down to 17 and 17 is down here on that lower crossbar, okay? So this is now a right, and rights go underneath horizontals. Underneath, underneath. That's an underneath. So you can see part of it you're going to weave. Part of it you're still, like, setting the warp. All right. So then we're going to come down here to 17. And because it is on the lower part, it goes underneath. going to do an advance, a left hand advance on 18. So we come to the right, 17, 18. 18 is an advance and then you're going to come down here. Yep. Eighteen is the advance and it is a left handed advance. So you go on top of it to the right. And then you're going to come back over here and do 19. Now, 19 to 20 is important because you want to be underneath. This is the first time you're going to do uh, X in the center. And then it actually starts looking like a Christmas tree the way you build it. But you have to get this one right. So from 19 to 20, it has to be correct. And I'll show you how to do that. But remember that your X's, when you do your horizontals, your X's are always on top of the horizontal. They're never below it. And if, if you look at it and think, 
Oh, well, see like this X is on top of a horizontal, that X is on top of a horizontal, this X is on top of a horizontal, your X's are always on top of a horizontal. So if you look at it and you're weaving, you think, well, what side do I go to? The X always goes on top of the horizontal.